Hello and welcome to another segment of Is He Full Of It? The game where deceit and deception is heavily rewarded and also ridiculed. Today we have stalwart defender Xavier Ellis. He's going to be put under the judge's eye. We've got Will Schofield, Shara Wellingham and Jeremy McGovern. And they're going to be judging whether or not Xavier Ellis is telling the truth or a lie today. If you'd pick your card for us here, please, Xavier. Righto, oh, gents. Read aloud, yeah, thanks. Loud, I man. once ate rat droppings by mistake. What did you mistake the rat droppings for? Chop chips. How old were you? Grade three. Where were the rat droppings? In my food. Were you at home yeah. or at school? School. I ordered a donut and uh, a rat must have um, chop chip donut, did, did droppings in the So in there was chop chip shop. and poop in there? Well, there was just poop. Just poop. So, what, what, so where was Why the chop chip? Where do you think the chop chip came well, from? Well, I just thought I was eating a chop chip donut. What did you order though? Cinnamon. <laughs> did, you have, did you have a problem with ordering I might, cinnamon? I might, I might have pinched a couple of from the tuck shop order ladies. <laughs> so you, you stole the donut in the first place? I stole the donut, yes. <laughs> so you didn't order a cinnamon donut? I ordered a cinnamon donut and pinched Buy one, pinch <laughs> <three>. <laughs> sold. Buy one, get one free. Um, yeah, how did you realise you were The eating? teacher called us in to ask whether we'd notice anything suspicious about our food. What, what, why was the teacher involved? Uh, because of the local bakery had realised what had happened. That's where you get your, they don't make it on site, they get it made at a bakery and then brought to the Which store. bakery? Lakes Entrance Bakery. How did they, how did the bakery realise what had happened when the donuts were already out of the... I, I don't think they made three donuts in the batch. I think they must have made a hundred. <laughs> they made a hundred with... There's a lot of rats. And well, I think they made a must... hundred with rat How many, on. How many, rat, how many poos do you think rats do? Uh, I'm not particularly sure. No, wait, so... He thinks the poos contaminated a hundred donuts. As no. I said, a lot of rats. Well, there, might be 30, <laughs> there might be 30 cinnamon donuts, I'm not sure. But how does the bat... Like, how does the bakery know that the rat... Well, I think they must have found some with... Did you eat the whole donut, or did you... Stop? I ate the entire donut. So and when you realised what happened that. after? Uh, when the teacher asked whether there was something suspicious about our donut, and I said... I ate a chocolate chip donut instead of a cinnamon donut. He's pretending to act stupid, but this is a true story. It's false, man. Do you think it's false? Why do you think it's false? You cannot mistake a chocolate chip for a rat. He's yeah, in year three. He's not, he's not, you know. I think that some of the story is just too easy. Like, yeah, it was just a school, it was the school bakery, I uh, stole the donut, I didn't really know what was going on. It's all just a bit too, make it up as you go along for me. So it's a fuck. Oh, yeah, he's lying. But it's up to you, Scott. Didn't happen. Didn't happen. <laughs> this is why you make the big decisions, mate. Huh? Take him down. You're full of it. <laughs> it's a true story. Oh, I knew it was a true story. Yeah. Nah, it's a true story. He was pretending Back. to be stupid about yeah, it. Yeah, nah, it's a true story. Oh, good. Oh, oh, oh.